Hi everyone. So in this question, we've been asked to use Simpson's rule with form intervals to estimate this integral. So we need to recall what Simpson's rule is. And this is the width of each interval, h, divided by three, multiplied by the sum of the endpoints, plus four lots of the odd y values, plus two lots of the even y values. So to work out h, the width of each drip, I'm going to quickly sketch this function. So here we've got a sketch of e to the x squared. And we're using four intervals between 0.4 and 2 to estimate the area underneath this curve. You can see that y2 is when x equals 1.2, which is halfway between 0.4 and 2. And then the odd values of y are here and here. So in this case, h would be the width of each strip, which is 0.4. So we'll need to create a table of x and y values between these two points. And then to work out the y values, we'll substitute each of these x values into this equation. And that will give us each of these, the three decimal places. So now we can substitute these into our equation and we'll get the integral of e to the x squared between 0 to 2 as approximately 0.4, which is our h value over 3, 4 lots of the odd y values, and 2 lots of the even. We can work out all of this on the calculator, and we get 0.4 over 3 times 123.54, which is the sum of all of this. And this works out as 16.5 units squared. Okay. Well, thank you for watching. I hope you found that useful. If you did find that helpful, please like and subscribe. And you can download the lessons on this topic from my website, mrmathematics.com.